Why are you looking at me? Because you did it. You like DC. I do like it DC. It's so hard. No. It's, here's the thing. It is hard to say, it is hard to say goodbye to yesterday. yesterday. Um, we've, been, we've been going on about it for probably since we started filming. This is our second Texas. take. <laughs> this is our second take. We had like gold for the first one. Um, and now you're left with this crap. Now you're left with this crap. <laughs> kind of like DC. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> um, no, but uh, we've been talking about the, the new 52 and our gripes with it uh, for a while now, and it's shown up here and there. We're going to try to get it all out of the way now just to, yeah. just to put it to bed. So we never talk Basically, about it again. Basically, yeah. this is going to be, we already spoke shitload about how, what we hate about the new 50, uh, 52, but we're going to talk about uh, what we miss yeah. from the old 52 and... Why we're sad, we're never going to see it again. We're going to pour one out for our homies, right, Gary? <laughs> Did I say it right? You so, need a 40. Isaac. I need a yes. 40. What's the thing you miss the absolute most? I missed, I missed the, uh, the friendships of the characters. Like, I mean, Jeff John's Teen Titans, they're, they're, they were friends. Dick Grayson used to have friends. He doesn't have friends anymore. Dick nah. Grayson doesn't have anything anymore. Yeah. Nah. I mean, now he's a super spy. He doesn't even but have Nightwing. He used to be. Nah. He had, he had Wally problem. West. He had Donna Troy. Yeah. He had Speedy. Aqualad, Speedy, Speedy. White Aqualad. Yeah. He had Tim Drake as a star kid, fire. as like his like surrogate kid brother. Yeah, and doesn't have that anymore. Nope. And it's just it's a loss of like the legacy yeah. of what the DC and legacy was like a big part of Jeff Johns' work with DC. In, we, in DC in general. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah. that was their in niche. In the Fifty Two, you can read Nightwing and be like, at any time he could be Batman. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Like, yeah. it, and he was. At one point, he was. He, he took charge it. of the Justice League. He earned it. Yeah, because he was. was cool. He had touched every single yeah. heroic aspect of the DC universe. <coughs> and then the new fifth two is just like, yeah. No. Here's Dick. Because well, that, that's what Dick. DC was going for with the new fifth two. They wanted to uh, de-age. They didn't know their, it. Yeah, yeah. They, they def, that was that, that, that definitely had to be their number of the yeah. top priority on their manifesto. All the WW2 characters gone. Yeah. Set up on another world, young, young and gay. That's actually like. A, <laughs> that's actually like a. Yeah. Uh, like uh, just terrible what they do with Jeff John's work. I mean, he was behind it, but I mean, all his JSA stuff is gone. Yeah, he was all able to see Green Lantern, stuff. and that's that was it. it. That yeah. was it. All his Teen yeah. Titans stuff gone. Yeah, and I mean, Everything that must bother him to a certain place. extent. It must bother him. I don't think it does because that paycheck must be real nice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it still exists on a bookshelf. Yeah, yeah. but it's the, it doesn't maybe, exist in continuity. Maybe in the back of his mind, he's just like. Dan DeDeo and uh, Diane Nelson, they gotta leave at some point. Yeah. Someday this will be mine. <laughs> See, like, things never change in comic books. Never. Like, yes. No. The, almost never. You almost know, never. Superman's always Superman. It's not gonna be replaced. But DC gave a thing where, like, maybe the heroes the, can grow up. And, and they can change. pass the torch. And that's why Dick Grayson was Robin, and then he became his own man. He became Nightwing. He became Robin, uh, Batman for a while. But Wally West was different. And Wally West is gone forever. But... <laughs> Yeah, well, he wasn't I remember. Coming back. I used to first. My first recollection of Flash was the Flash TV show on uh, CBS Jeez. or whatever, yeah. and that was Barry Allen. So Flash was Barry Allen, as far as I knew. And then I read a comic book. It was an Elseworlds annual, mm -hmm. and Wally West was in. I was like, "Who the fuck is this guy?" <laughs> and then I just I went back and I read a bunch of stuff, and like he grew up into the role. He went from not a superhero to Kid Flash, became Flash, earned it, became a major hero. Saved the Earth. Was Saved the Earth many times. Got the girl. Was the got, the girl. Got, got the, the happy ending. Got the, got, he was like, yeah, the happy ending. Yeah. Yeah. Got married. No one else get that. No. DC and then they weren't allowed they went, to marry yeah. anymore. But see, yeah. that's the thing. They went from giving him a happy ending to giving him no ending. There is yeah. no they ending. Took him away. The Wally West story, as we know it, is, is yeah. just it's open. It's open. It, it, yeah. it, it pains me because I still remember sitting in on a Flashpoint panel from 2010 where Jeff Johns basically was up on stage and he said... This was, he's building a Flashpoint, and they were showing off that uh, Hot Pursuit character, which was a speedster yeah, with a motorcycle. Yeah. And he didn't want to say who it was yet, but he, he basically did say, he's like, it's all going to lead to this, this big story arc that I have called Flashpoint, and it's going to involve the whole Flash family. Mm -hmm. And then I guess and that maybe, got thrown out the maybe window. Maybe at one point yeah. that was true, but that's not what we got. No. That no, just involved yeah. Barry. So we were talking about uh, the things we missed from the uh, old 52 that we wish were in the new 52. What do you miss? Ah. Uh, Ah, I miss, honestly, it's a little bit to go off of what uh, Isaac was talking about, but I miss the connective tissue of the DCU. Everything feels very disconjointed, whereas, like, you have the Green Lantern stuff out in space, and you have the, well, Aquaman and Wonder Woman, they're dealing with the whole Greek mythology right now, and then Batman stuff is all Batman stuff. But I miss seeing, like, Batman needing help from, like, uh, Martian Manhunter, 
or like I need a psychic for this mission. Nobody or, likes Martian Manhunter yeah. now. And uh, yeah, uh, I miss yeah. Martian Manhunter being a superhero. You know. When's the last time you had an Oreo cookie? No. <laughs> you mean a Choco? Choco? Not in this yeah, world. Yeah, Choco. Choco. There's there are no Chacos in this world. But I, I, and then on top of that, I miss the characters that they introduced to us and that are just gone now. Like Wally West is gone, but. There's characters that they were literally building towards right before the old 52 ended that mm. we were expecting to see and more of. Perfect example, Aqualad, Calderon. Mm. You know, that we had a black Aqualad. That was awesome. Mm. I, was, I remember cool. being so souped for him. Exactly. I read, I, I went out Brightest and bought day. Brightest Day because Johns was building it up. Yeah. And I was like, wow, that's so awesome. And then, cool. and once the new 52 happened, they were still talking like, oh no, I'm going to introduce him. I'm going to bring him in and stuff. And then they, um, in his uh, Aquaman run, he was talking about the Seven Kingdoms mm. and one of them was a desert. And I was like, wow, could that be <coughs> where Aqualad is? He's in just like this desert kingdom or something, you know? And then I like once he left the book, that was yeah. gone. So like now there's like no hope. Come come correct it, correct me if I'm wrong. The the de- the new fifty two Aquaman does not uh, the Black Manta in <clears throat> that was that appeared in there mm-hmm. is solely human. Yeah, he's solely okay. human. Solely human. Yeah, he's solely human. Okay. So there's no there's no chance of that being that like Calderon his, would yeah. be his son unless yeah. he's half and half. But I feel so. like I feel like Teen Titans. Not it, Teen Titans. Young Justice. Young Justice. Yeah. The cartoon was part well, of the old fifty two, and then like it was so good and we enjoyed it. Why and was then, it canceled again? Uh, they didn't sell enough toys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was about their toy line. Yeah. They weren't selling merchandise. Yeah. But what's and funny is there was no merchandise to sell. to sell. Yeah, they came out with the one toy line, the, yeah. and then they came out with There's, the game yeah. that no one talked about well, the game, anywhere. The game didn't come out until after the show was kind yeah. of Yeah, and I'm saying, but they had it in development, yeah. and no one was talking about it at all. Because I remember knowing about it like in season one of Young Justice. Yeah. I feel what like time they, was the show aired? Um, like so Friday was, nights. It was like was Friday nights at like eight, the first season. Because remember, they played it in November. It was a... A one hour movie. Yeah, yeah. This was, yeah and that was before the uh, Cartoon Network decided to reformat their satellite and Saturdays to create block. the DC yeah. Nation. Which I thought was brilliant. It, was it had the shorts, it yeah. had uh, Green, Lantern. Green Lantern, which I wasn't sold on originally. Oh, yeah. But you know, I was like, you know, it's from the Batman Tim, and Bruce Tim, Tim, yeah. Tim, so I have to watch this. And it got better, progressively better. Yeah. They just didn't give it a chance to grow. No, that's not what DC does anymore. That's not the what thing, WB does. The thing that, that hurts me the most is that. Um, Kicking the balls. Everyone hates DC now. Well, <laughs> yeah, sure. That does kind of get annoying and gets old because, you know, you can only hear fuck DC so, so many, many times. times before you're like, I like DC. Though. It's just like, all right, now what is it this time? No, but in all seriousness, the thing that, that bugs me the most, and it is connected to, to Wally in such a way, is that um, this, this notion of family, whether it's by blood or by just... Relationship. Just yeah. like bonds, is kind of shattered. I mean, the mm-hmm. Bat family... More or less stayed together. No, but, no, no I'd no. say that that's an even better. That's an example for it too. That's a that's a, a, a pro for your argument <laughs> for the simple fact that they eliminated the family element. Um, Tim Drake isn't just oh, no, like no, an no, adopted no, 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 Batman. No, no, that's anymore. not what I mean though. No, what I'm talking about is like in Batman, you still have Batman and you still have he's all still his the, wards, yeah, and sons, they're all still so, okay, they're all okay. still connected. Where so whereas Barry, Barry, what made Barry interesting to me at least prior to the Flashpoint spoilers. was that yeah. Barry was. Um, at the center of what was the Flash, Flash family. family. Yeah. You had Jake Garrett, who came from the Golden Age, and he was essentially an older Flash, a more experienced Flash, words of wisdom. You had Barry, who was essentially the... The Flash the, the center point. <laughs> and then he died. So you had Wally step in and take his place. Now Wally became the focal point. And from Wally, you then met... You got to meet Bart other Allen, members. You got to meet uh, Max Jesse Mercury, Mercury, Jesse Quick, Johnny Quick. You had... Bart Allen, Allen introduced, and Bart Allen was then Bart Allen was cool. treated yeah, as yes. I never yeah, thought yeah, I would the same way that like came that into was so I really miss Bart Allen. Yeah. Well, Jeff Johnson did a good job with turning Impulse into Kid Flash. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And Peter David did a good job with Impulse. And didn't he yes. do it in one issue? It was one issue yeah. where he was like, okay, yeah. it's well, time for you to step up. Shot, shot him in the knee, and, and then he went, and it was like, I'm calm now. With Flashpoint, now we just Barry all on his own, and now we get this kid name Wally that I'm just like that's not Wally that's not it's not Walter because he's there. not black it's because he's... the rest of the family's gone I don't give a shit about this character I don't they're give gonna... a shit about I- Iris' they're trying brothers to force, yeah. they're trying to force the, the like the caring because Flash in the future loves yeah, Wally. he loves well, him that, that so was just one of the reviews that yeah. I read where they were yeah. like um, oh well you know like they, the writer keeps throwing it out that we should care yeah. about Wally we should Barry. care about Show Wally because Barry in 20 years Wally. Barry cares about him from from that one, one preview page, where no. that was like Wally's big introduction, no. I don't care about him. No. I don't, that's not a kid that I would like. Well, that's you know? I don't know if yeah. we talked about this in this version or if we talked about it in the last version that we had to cut. No. But like the Wally West, it's like it's just a generic, like they want to make diversity, yeah. but it's less, less than that yeah, because exactly. it's racist, I think. introduced. He's a troubled kid. 
with from a trouble family. family, and then the white guy comes on. The white guy with blonde hair and blue eyes comes along. Like the savior, the savior, show him the, the, the way yeah. to be an upstanding citizen now, and hero that he's supposed to be. The world don't move. <laughs> you just one drum. <laughs> what might be right for you may not be right for some. You know, I see this movie. What you talking about, Barry? <laughs> <laughs> to be fair with the Flash family, they were pulling back from the Flash family I even before. Right? Before, yeah. Before, because they wanted Barry Allen to be the focus, and that's it. But Why? it was still there. And and it was still there. And and it, and and now, <laughs> but now you have a young Jake Eric on Earth 2, and while I'm liking the Book Earth 2, I'm not liking it because, because they're ages. Yeah. I'm liking it because Tom Taylor actually came in and just was like, you know what, I'm going to make this book interesting. But yeah. they're not. They're not the And that, that was the thing about Barry, and that's why they're starting to move away from him, is because he had no personality. Yeah. Oh, no. He had he no was, personality. And now there's like, you see, you see him talking and it's like that's a little bit of Wally West you remember, that, you remember that moment in Crisis not in Infinite Crisis when Batman's like the last time you were in Inspiration was when the you best died, thing died. died. Yeah, that, that was, was the best the, thing you that did. was the best thing Barry sure. Allen did yeah. was die in the crisis because he was a hero went out a hero inspired people and that was it even when he came back, even like, like, when he came back, it wasn't like I know it was a big deal in the yeah. comic world and everything. But it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't anything. It no. wasn't anything that I would be like, wow, my, what a great moment. My problem with him coming back was just like he. It shouldn't have even been a big deal because at any given point, the Barry from the future timeline could have just shown up and be like, hey guys, I'm here to help yeah. out, and then I and gotta go did. back. Yeah, exactly. I did a bunch of times, but Barry was never my Flash. I was born in 1984. Crisis exactly. happened in 1985. Yeah. So I never had Barry Allen in the plus, except for the. <laughs> you read it as a one year old. No, I, I was born in eighty three. I was eighty three. Once you get a hit, I was sitting there two years old, just like one day, Samuel. Barry Allen. <laughs> 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 no, but yeah, for like a lot of kids around our age, our Flash was Wally West because we had the Justice League cartoon. Yeah, we grew up with Wally West. We saw him. We we grew up with him. Yeah, that was the best part. Like he was he was exactly he was a little kid just like us. The same way we came we came up with Dick Grayson and the rest of the legacy characters. Yeah, we're like we. We like fell in love with the character. He grew up. He got married. He had kids. We fell for him, and then suddenly, he's gone. He doesn't exist. And you see, that's a, that's another like negative point for DC is because now the next generation who's starting to read comic books isn't going to have the same legacy characters no. the way we grew up with and legacy characters. That's Jeff Johns' biggest crime. Yeah. He made us care too much. Too much. Yes. And now we're hurting. Oh, the no, right. he made no, us care too much. Not that much. Is that he didn't try to defend the way the universe was. Yeah. The fact that he went along with it, like he was well, just following. He went. I'm mean, fine he, with he, it. Honestly, I gotta say, how much can one man do? Because yeah. he saved Dick Grayson. How many times? Yeah. yeah. Like literally, yeah. there was some, like editors was like, no, we gotta kill Dick. Oh, like, there's a lot of people who doing it. Us, but kill him. There's a lot of people. There's a lot of people responsible. For Why is he even a thing? Yeah. It's like explain to me when Flash. Oh, like, no, no, no. no. <laughs> 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 but yeah, Flashpoint was like Flashpoint happened, and bam, we're in the new Fifty Two, and everything we knew <coughs> just died. Everything like we loved back then. No. I wish that how it happened. Yeah. I wish that everything yeah, I knew. I wish everything was gone. Me too. It sucks so that I have to see things that used to exist yeah. and other things that went along with it so it's like well not the there. Yeah. It's, it's like, like there's a the piece room. of the puzzle puzzle, puzzle missing. There's like you have these robins in a span of five, five years, years. There's a span and like they were supposed to be like difference in ages. There can't be anymore. Exactly. And now they're all like jumbled there's, in there's, there's no little brother to. No. to well, they made uh, it seem like nothing. in Flashpoint that there was a point to it, like there was a larger story about yep. why these worlds had yep. to merge. Fla- yeah. <laughs> like, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Flash ran yeah. so fast. What are you talking about? Like it, was, now it's got it was so Pandora could get her boob, uh, boom tube, yeah. and uh, you know, yeah. sin. They had no <laughs> idea. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but like, uh, but what I meant was like everybody we knew back then is is basically gone. You know, they never got a chance. <laughs> Fight what was gonna happen. They never had a chance That's to right. be like some of them did. Crisis ended like you know it was a big thing. Like they were fighting against like creation. Flashpoint was Barry just running around through time trying to save his mom. Save his mom. Exactly. Oh, yes. Yes. He just ran back in time, and all of a sudden everything's changed. Wally could have died saving the universe, and that would have been fine. They could have done something else to like if they showed fighting. closure for these characters. Yeah, if you're gonna end the universe, end it. Yeah, you know, don't just say it doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they should have started from the beginning. Cut so yes. lastly, on this whole DC thing. Diversity. Let's just get this nah. diversity Diversity's thing out of the way. Um, Taking a white character and making them black isn't diversity. No, <coughs> it's nope. it's, it's insulting I, to it's, it's insulting to both races. It just looks it's different. insulting to say that any white yeah. person can go, ahead. go. I said <laughs> it just looks desperate. It does. It is. Yeah. yeah. They want like attention. Marvel, they do it smoothly with um, Kamala Khan. Mm-hmm. You know, it's just like okay, so he, but now it's just like let's just make him black because who's Kamala Khan? Miss Marvel. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Miss <laughs> Marvel. We talked about her last year. You we guys did. should know this. Yeah. You should, you should be doing Keep your own. up. There is a test. 
Getting angry, sleepy. <laughs> 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 no, but yeah, it, was like oh, it, it looks like desperate. It. Like they're just trying to keep up with yeah. everyone else. Made out, got someone... gay, just shit. But see, no, that, that worked. No, Did it though? no. Did it see, and here's here's where I'm gonna go with the Alan Scott thing. The Alan Scott thing. As much as I love Kyle Rayner, Kyle Rayner oh, did give us the the woman in the refrigerator <laughs> syndrome, right? And that's exactly what happened to Alan Scott. Oh, yeah. They yeah. were like, oh, he's gay. Here's his gay boyfriend. Here's his dead boy. Here's his dead gay boyfriend. Oh, maybe he'll find love again. Oh, no. James Robinson's leaving the book. Yeah. But he's not Good even a Green Lantern. He's not a Green Lantern. He's like Swamp Thing. Yeah. Yeah. He has the powers of the Green. green. Yeah. He's not and, a Green Lantern. But no. Flash is not a Flash. <coughs> yeah, and here's, and here's the thing that's diversity. really annoying about diversity is like, take Earth 2 out of the situation. <laughs> I hate diversity. I hate diversity. It's such a bad idea. Here's, <laughs> no, here's the thing where, like, where I call bullshit on this whole Wally West is about diversity because it's fucking not. It's, not. it's a lie. No. It's about Earth sales. 2, yeah. Earth 2 for even with its fault, with the way it's handled, Alan Scott has done diversity right. We're getting a black Superman that's going to be awesome. We're getting, we have a really cool, interesting uh, uh, Muslim Dr. Fate. We have right? a red Lois Lane. Cool. We He's have, a robot. We yeah. have a robotic Lois Lane. But <laughs> robot we savior. have, I think, uh, they, they, they reintroduced, did they, is, is uh, Red Arrow? Aqu- Aquawoman is Aquaman black. Aquawoman is, is, is Indian. Yeah. An arrow. There's is, a red arrow. Is he? I'm not sure who he is. Oh, Asian okay. or no? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, or but, like they're doing like the Connor yeah. Hawk thing. But then, yeah. Okay. But then you look at you look at the the main universe. You had Vixen. All right, what happened to Vixen? Oh, she's crippled, and now she's out of the Very entire nice. universe. David Zembe, uh, Zembe, Zembe dead. The, the African oh, Batwing, yeah. dead. <laughs> dead. <laughs> um, I, I almost uh, called him. Uh, I have Rice, again. Gone. Oh, oh, the Green Lantern. Um, oh, what is his Simon name? Baz. Simon, Simon Baz. Baz. Simon Baz. Uh, he's in Firestorm's head. Maybe he'll have an important storyline for a year. Won't. For a year, he was their honestly. He was their best handle. Oh, he was, in, he was in Red Lanterns. He was in Red Lanterns. Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah that's why right. he showed up with like he showed up with his chipmunk. Yeah. Just just to get screamed at by Hal Jordan's brother. Mm-hmm. Man, I don't respect you, yeah. Muslim. <laughs> that's what that. That's what that page was. But Wait, was, that, that was, that was that when somehow. Peter Milligan was still on it, or is that no, 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 that, that was Charles Soule. He didn't kill yeah. the He just he had the reason. Okay, but the, the characters that they did have, like the Blue oh, Beetle yeah, and everything, like if they're not gonna give like A list talent and support and backing to them, of course, new heroes that are black or. Asian or whatever aren't going to find if the an book audience. sucks. The yeah. book's not going to You don't give you don't give Jeff Loeb Hawkeye. You give him no. to fraction, and he yeah. makes it gold. Yeah. You know, you give the the characters that need help. You give Moon <coughs> Knight to Warren Ellis, yeah. and it becomes a top seller. Yeah. You, you know, you don't put Scott Snyder on seventeen Batman books. <laughs> no. You know, oh. Jeff Johns. You put Jeff Johns on Aquaman. Look what happens. Awesome. And now Jeff Parker can come oh in after God, that, and he's good. doing yeah. just as good. But you know, you not do? better. You know, you don't do. I mean, as happy, and I made we made this video. Ah, uh, way, way back in like December or January, I was so happy that um, Jeff Loeb was le- not Jeff Loeb, uh, Scott Lobdell, Scott Lobdell Scott was, was leaving, leaving Teen Titans. Titans, and I was like, finally, we're gonna get a Teen Titans that's gonna be better. Yeah, nope. And then I found out that the writer that's doing it is a guy that did Amazon Attack, and I was like, fuck this. Yeah. So, so no, we, we, twice. Can't get, we can't get a good Teen Titans. Book. No, I don't no. think we can not because there sure are no Teen Titans. There's no teens. There shouldn't be. There's no they marriage sure built up to it. You have it makes what you're saying is this criminal mastermind from the future. Who? You, oh, he's yeah, a yeah, bar, yeah. bar tour. You have yeah. a Superboy who's no, a he's clone, or I have dead. no fucking idea. He's, he's, he's a clone is. of the clone son of, of Lois Lane and Clark Kent from an evil universe yeah. in the future. But and no, he's, he's trying dead. to do and good. And the other guys yeah. in and then who else is there? Wonder, Wonder Girl, who has no she's, history. She's never been she with stole Wonder something, Wonder and that's how she became. Yeah, she stole. She stole her her items. Yeah. Right. The uh, the only thing that that book might have is it'll have uh, Gar in it, and he'll yeah. be green again, and he'll be green again, and Raven. And you Too. know what? I liked Bunker. I hate, was, I hate Bunker. No, 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 no. I, I didn't have a problem with Bunker. Bunker's another issue I have with them in trying to do ethnic characters. Because yeah. it's like, hey guys, I'm gay because I'm gay. <coughs> and I'm going to remind you every page I'm of them. Gay I'm gay and Spanish. I'm, exactly. I'm gay and Spanish. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm pink. Exactly. Yeah. My powers have to be pink. I'm going to use catchy phrases yeah. that are going to remind Bunker, you every page. Bunker was bad because he was written by Scott. So, Scott yeah. Exactly. I have faith that Bunker could be a good character. It's just... I know who's taking over... Who's taking over Teen Titans? Will Pfeiffer. Oh, yay. Yeah, I said I had, I had hope. <laughs> nah. I hate the look of. The, there's still the Jeff Lemire. There's the Jeff Lemire. Yeah, she's yeah. got the feathers. There's the Jeff Lemire Teen Titans arc cover. That might be. That doesn't count. That doesn't yeah. count. And, count. and again, that's in a world that doesn't even have super superheroes. It's exactly. So they're not teen. They're not sidekicks. New Fifty Two. There's no Superboy. New Fifty Two. So what they're telling us is that their demographic is for. Um, for the ages of 20 to 25, unmarried, no children. Yeah. Because there's no T Titans, no. there's no marriage, no. and there's no legacies. So it's like this is the only demographic that we're going for. Yeah. If you're not in your 
mid twenties, then DC is not for you right now. Actually, I think D- right now DC, if you read the whole series, if you read everything, the only person it's good for is Dan Vidal. Yeah, yeah, yeah he must be having a blast. He's yeah. like, I love these books. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're and, doing sales. That's why I yeah. stopped. Getting, that's why I stopped reading Flash because they were like. Oh, and we must be doing something good because we sold out. We sold well, out. Like, well, not anymore. I'm not going to buy it. There you go. Yeah. You lost me, asshole. Yeah. Right. See, yeah, I didn't care about the end. I'm not going to oh, support yeah. that. That does it for uh, our gripes with these. Our whole big I, I diversity just... tomorrow because today is almost over. <laughs> what were you going to say, Isaac? I just, I just missed my Teen Titans. I, I, this is we're talking about a brand that at one Miss, point rivaled the X. I miss Superman, Mary the Lois. I miss yeah. Crypto. They had a good relationship. Superboy and Wonder Girl were together. They, yes. I mean, they would never, I mean, God forbid they got together now because we knew where Superboy came from. Yeah, yeah. that made sense. Yeah. Was Lex Luthor. Was Lex Luthor. That was awesome. Oh, we didn't see a bunch of Wallstone characters that just show up and then disappear. Yeah. Yeah. I miss Bart Allen. Awesome Adam. crossovers. <coughs> I never sense. thought I would miss Bart Allen. Exactly. Miss oh, they're, they're, they're the characters that you didn't even care about you missed. Yeah. yeah. Be, just because of what they contributed. I miss, I miss Vixen. I miss Vixen. <laughs> Oh, okay, I'm okay, I'll fix it. I miss, I miss, uh... I miss, like, Nightwing and Wally just talking. Green Arrow's good. Green Arrow's great. You man. know what? Fuck this. Tonight I'm watching Young Justice on Netflix. And on that note, I'll see you guys next week. Bye! Bye.